Hi Aquarius, it's Elle here to do your weekly read. Um, we're supposed to have seven cards, but eight cards came out for you, so it is what it is. Um, thank you to those who like, share, comment, subscribe to the channel. This is for June 16th through the 22nd. Okay, uh, let's get into it. So Aquarius, this... <laughs> And you see the cards. I'm not going to go through the cards. Overall energy is the tower. What's under the tower is the ace of pentacles. Can you see that? Okay. All right. Aquarius. Very good things are coming in. It's happening for you. Because I have the, the clarifying cards here in my hand um and we'll go over the clarifying cards over on the other side uh, if you feel like this reading resonates with you aquarius so it's so much so i'm trying to kind of like put it all together right it, and try to at least get the key points This is an Aquarius who it, who has prayed for, manifested in, in, in the terms of doing the work here in the, you know, on earth, in the earthly realm to get whatever it is that they want, that they have been praying for. This is, this is for an Aquarius that has done just that. Um, and it's coming in for you and you see it and you see it happening uh but the one thing you have to do aquarius is what the cards is saying is that you have to change uh your habits your thought patterns that early that early learned thinking and, and, and thought patterns toward maybe the opposite sex uh, toward life in in its entirety you have to change your own personal philosophy to get what it is you want because there has been for a specific Aquarius or a number of specific Aquarius a fear of commitment and since there has been a fear of commitment um, the Aquarius I wrote it down I have to say this because it came to me okay. so since there's been a fear of commitment um, there has been a, a situation where the Aquarius has not been keeping things in their life they've been a able to acquire and to have but for a short spell but not be able to maintain um, and that may be a tribute to the fact that you were never committed to having and holding those particular things whether it be a relationship uh, home car job uh, committed to family life and motherhood fatherhood whatever uh, this is an Aquarius who has to change their thought patterns around almost every aspect of their life. Definitely for the things that they want because this Aquarius has really good things coming in for them. They have manifested these things. They have an understanding and inner knowledge of what is to come and what they want in their life. And they almost have been given um, a glimpse or um, a look into the future so now they continue to stay on that path in regards to getting whatever it is they want Aquarius it says that you want a lot right um, but then there's a fear of commitment of merging uh, there's a fear maybe of intimacy um, of sharing shared resources shared finance um, you may have been uh, a victim of 
having given your all in been in a place of sharing and it just didn't turn out well for you you got the short end of the stick so now there is an Aquarius or if it never happened to you you saw it happen maybe in your upbringing because it talks about early education here you, so how you were educated in regards to life and relationship it says Aquarius this this old dynamic of thinking of doing has to come down the tower has to come down because most of everything that you want is going to have to come with or it comes with some level of committing either to self and being completely determined in in one fashion in one focus or committing to another and trusting trusting your convictions and knowing that it will land you where you want to be um, plainly spoken Aquarius some of you want great things whatever that may mean to you because it's going to be defined differently for all of us right but some, some of the stuff you're not going to be able to get without Partnering, joint ventures, shared resources, shared finances, a new mindset, um, working together as, instead of alone, um, oh, okay, so if you do want to do this all alone, then it may take you longer to get wherever it is you're trying to be or whatever you, whatever it is you're trying to accomplish you also may have someone coming in um, it says don't turn down any offers that will get you to where you, you want to be um, you may have someone coming in offering uh, what could seem too good to be true or definitely definitely life changing um, you have to trust that this is a beneficial change and you have to um, you have to accept it this is an Aquarius has to get slightly out of the driver's seat and sit in the passenger seat just for a while and this is hard for a particular Aquarius to do or maybe a set of you I'm so tempted to show you the cards in my hand, but I want to save it for the other side because they're very, very good. These cards are good. There's no bad card here. It says in order to get what you want, you're going to have to play your cards right. You're going to have to... Um, some of you are ferociously independent. You're going to have to kind of, you know, let the, the ivory tower fall just a bit or, or all together uh, and some of you it may not even be financial for you it may be that you're you're good financially you're great but this could be emotionally you have built a wall up so high that in order for you to even get what it is you are praying for you are manifesting it's here it's here for the taking but your tower is so high that you you won't see it or you it won't 100% come in to you because you have to do some emotional work it says you make you make really good choices there's a lot of wisdom that rests with you Aquarius but there also needs to be a change of um, personal philosophy um, because in order to have this beneficial change that you've been praying for you have to change Aquarius meet me on the other side and we can talk more about this especially the um, the cards that I have in my hand which are very very good and it speaks to the changes that are coming in if an Aquarius changes within 
it's like you say you want all of these things and it, you define what the things are right but then you your actions speak otherwise or like your pre pre disposition is or your disposition is just like not aligned with what you say you want so now it's a it's about getting an alignment something habitual something that you do every day in regards to work ethics ethics and money also It says that you have to get committed to something, maybe a creative project or something that you do, some ability that you have, then you can have real stability here also. And then maybe the merging can come in for you. There's somebody who really wants to help you and really wants to merge their life with yours. But the Aquarius is the the Aquarius is <laughs> they'll say they're open to it, but the actions speak otherwise. They're very guarded, so to speak. Alright, maybe another side Aquarius. It's always two dollars twenty-five cents to get the extended read. Thank you. Take care. Have a really good week. Looks like a week of breaking down the dynamic, the old dynamic. Bring in that new, okay? All right, take care, Aquarius.